It's life. What's good, y'all? Welcome back to the lab with another quest build. I've been in the laboratory for days tinkering, just trying to find something that has been undiscovered, and I finally found a straight stone cold murderer. It has shades of Emeka Okafor, Bam Wallace, and Alonzo Mourning. Do you paint houses, Irishman? I'm talking about the skilled paint defender. Never before seen quest build through and through the first ever this is like a bigfoot hatch this thing is a straight killer it is an atrocity this thing is a beast i'm going to get into the builder there's certain attributes that can't go over a certain point so if you want the name skilled paint defender do it just like this and then maybe go back and tinker at the end um, but this is never before seen at this point so you're going to make this a center and you are going to be six nine you're going to max your weight out to 283, and you're going to put your wingspan at 7.6. You're going to go built. You know, this body type actually matters because you want to intimidate every single player you come across in the city. So, you might disagree with some of these attributes, but again, you got to tinker to get this crazy name. So, we're actually going to punt close shot. And this is a little bit Ben Wallace. Uh, you know, you're not going to be called upon to ISO and do your own thing, but you're going to get your driving layup to a 71. You're going to get your driving dunk to an 81. You're going to max out your standing dunk and you're going to max out your post control. That's going to give you 15 finishing badges. As you can see, Hall of Fame post spin, back down, poster riser, rise up. You're basically going to get three of those if you want them. Gold uh, fearless finisher, you're going to at least have three Hall of Fame finishing badges, so you're going to be yamming like an absolute monster. I think 15 is, uh, this feels kind of like a paint beast, but you'll see defensively that this thing is absolutely gruesome. You're going to max out your midi, max out your three ball. That's an 82 midi and a 79 three. That is plenty to hit in this game for sure. And then you're going to get your free throw to a 34. That's going to give you eight shooting badges. Again, fade ace on Hall of uh, dead eye on gold, catch and shoot on gold. You're going to be able to hit jumpers with this build and step out to the three point line. Uh, this is, oh, man, this build is disgusting. You're going to get your pass actually to a 79. Your ball handle, get that to a 70. And then get your speed uh, with ball to a 61. So you're going to take one off of that. Uh, here's a good time to uh, reiterate you can't put your driving dunk over an 81. Or you become a skilled interior force. Check out my other video on that. Uh, that's the first one that we've ever discovered on 2K as well. Um, but so this is you know very similar. You can't have your pass accuracy over 79, uh, or it becomes a two-way playmaker um, with the ball handle over 66. So again, skilled paint defender. Obviously, you're gonna max out your interior defense here. Max out your perimeter D. Punch your steelies. Max out your block. And then get your defensive rebounds to a 90. Yeah, you're going to be grabbing basically every rebound down there, uh, which also brings up your offensive rebounds to a 65. That gives you 21 defense. Oh, and I missed 14 playmaking badges. You're going to have all the passing uh, badges you want, but you're going to have gold, quick first, Hall of Fame uh, space creator, gold downhill. Being 6'9 allows you to unlock a lot more badges um, and it has a lot more diversity as a center. Um, and then 21 defensive badges. This is where the Ben Wallace, the Alonzo Mourning, uh, really come out to play. This thing is going to lock up opposing bigs because you're going to see here, we're going to max out the speed and acceleration, 68, 64 respectively. You could actually probably lower the weight and tinker with this if you want to. It might be able to, you might be able to put more badges on here, but I want to be absolutely physically imposing. I want to be a Yeti, uh, the abominable snowman. I want to be a Bigfoot. I want to be a Loch Ness monster. These things are found at the depths of the abyss. This is crypto. These things have never been discovered before, but we found one. So you're going to get your strength to a 90, going to get your vertical to a 75 that is plenty freakish and then you're going to max out your stamina to an 80 and let's just look this over real quick 15 finishing with a lot of those hall of fame dunking badges eight shooting plenty enough to be able to step out and hit that jumper and be a threat in comp 14 playmaking 
this thing's going to be disgusting. Like, what do you even do with a skilled paint defender? I mean, if you're guarding that and he's he looks like King Kong, <laughs> what do you what do you do? And 21 defensive badges. Come on now, 90 strength. You're not these aren't show muscles. Okay, this is left side curtains on God swear. This is off rip. You are an absolute monster. So let's get to the takeovers. You can get shooting takeover with this, playmaking take, post or interior defense. I'm going to get just buck wild with this, and I'm going to intimidate everybody off primary. You're going to have that the longest. And then I, if I get that secondary takeover, I'm going power back downs. No one on planet Earth will be able to stop this atrocity when he gets in the lane. And there you have it, the first ever skilled paint defender. I'm shivering in my boots. I'm deep sea diving for deep sea demons right now. Hashtag deep sea demons in the comments below. Let's put this in the builder and test it out, see if it passes the eye test at a 90 plus. Y'all know the drill, quest barrel, quest builds, we in the lab. 